Barrel, there's a lot of academic opportunities that are different from what I hear from other high schools. We actually were a middle school. We had parents continually coming back saying that they wanted an elementary school, they wanted a high school. Well, after hearing that, we actually uh, introduced the elementary, then the high school academy. Facilities is probably, as a leader, my greatest issue. We're really at the mercy to just take facilities that are offered to us or facilities that we find that at least meet the building codes that you can put a school in. Statewide, in the state of California, most public school construction is financed through the issuance of school bonds. Historically, charter schools have not been included in school bond uh, programs equitably. Good news is now with Prop Z, the charter schools in Santa Unified are able to apply for funds to be able to build the facilities uh, that can meet their students' needs. Through Prop Z and CCSA's support of getting Prop Z passed uh, enabled us to actually put in a proposal to build a high school where kids could stay here and then be educated in a way that we felt would make them competitive to enter college. Prop Z is really important. It's the first of its kind. For a charter school to be able to apply for this size of facility grants has never happened before. Prop Z is a bond measure which will provide approximately $350 million in public school construction funds that will benefit local charter students. With the high school being built, everyone's excited because they'll feel like they go to a real school. By the time the Prop Z program is complete, more than 40 San Diego charter schools will have received funding under the program. The charter school movement and Prop Z kind of pinpoints the idea that kids come first, their needs come first, and if they're based on kids' needs, you'll see cities around the state implementing uh, initiatives like Prop Z. San Diego will be the model for other cities to look at when they establish their own propositions. Charter schools are public schools and they should have access to the same funding sources for school facilities as school district schools do. In San Diego, thanks to Proposition Z, uh, charter school students are having those opportunities now where they have not historically in other parts of the state. I think this program should be replicated throughout the state, if not the nation.